Hey everybody, it's back on the road again. Another day of heading out to work. You know, work, work, work. Earn that money. Spend that money. Lose that money. I don't know. <laughs> it's a cycle. You gotta do it. You gotta do it. So, heading to work right now. Enjoy the day. Today, I uh, went grocery shopping. A little later than I wanted to. It's like, oh, come on. We gotta get going. We gotta get going. We gotta get going. And, uh, you know, up to the last minute. I mean, I got... I'm 27 minutes away from work and I'm leaving half an hour until so uh, I might be driving a little fast basically everybody drives a little fast so I'll be driving at everyone else's speed so so you know I'm planning to go on vacation very soon uh, we're going to be going to um, I think it's a uh, Egyptian uh, museum out in San Jose it's going to be heading out there um, next week also, we're going to hit, um, I think, the mystery spot, or no. After that, we're going to go straight to the, the Museum of Ice Cream in uh, San Francisco. And we're going to go there. Then, uh, for my anniversary with my wife on Saturday, um, we're going to go to, uh, what was it, thing? Uh, either it's going to be the Sacramento Underground Tour or the Gold Rush something tour. Along with a train ride or a boat ride. My wife hasn't finalized her decision yet. Because, you know, if the wife ain't happy, nobody's happy. <laughs> and we all know that's true. If you know what I'm saying, go ahead and leave a comment down below. A little thumbs up there would be appreciated. <laughs> yeah, you know, you gotta keep people, you know, you don't, can't always make everyone happy, but you gotta make the wife happy. Because the wife will um, act, ultimately determine the mood of the house. I'm getting ready to go on Highway 4. A little hot. wonder if you guys are going to hear the air conditioner as I crank it up all the way. Uh, oh. My eyeball just iced over. <laughs> Forgot to take my allergy to medicine today again. Oh, someone did this something illegal. Double solid line. Uh, there's always someone like that on the road. You gotta watch out for these people. And especially around this area, they're all over the place. You can signal all you want, and they'll still try to take your spot. I'm doing about 70. Going past some hills here. Coming up to another fellow forerunner. Last time I did this, uh, someone gave me a thumbs up. Uh, this time it was a lady, not a guy. A guy gave me a thumbs up. Guess the forerunners run together. Oh, now she's behind me. So, it's a nice little sunny day here in California, and it's not too hot. Of course, with the windows all rolled up and glass being glass, it magnifies the heat. That's why I have the air conditioner cranked up. Plus, I like it either really hot or really cold. got to be careful. Last night I encountered a guy who was drunk ahead of me. That's one thing about this camera or this phone. It doesn't record very well at night. If you have any suggestions how to do that on the iPhone, an iPhone SE. Um, if there's any filter, lenses, or anything out there that could help, just let me know. Because I'm always trying to improve my, uh, my vlog. Trying to improve uh, my life. I went to the gym. I... Uh, you know, I had a, an episode where I had to chase after someone when the, their product was finally off their, their, um, their shopping cart. And I had to run out there and catch it before it would have broke. And I accidentally uh, uh, popped the knee cap. Not too bad, but enough for it to um, actually just make a poppy noise. Alright, let me turn this thing out. It's drying out my eyeballs. And then after that, my knee's been hurting for about three days now. Oh, just one knee, the right knee. Maybe he's just showing me I need to be more active. You go out there and do more things. 
So if you guys have any interesting uh, things you're going to do this summer, go ahead and leave a comment below. Okay. Yeah, one of the things I would love to do this summer, and I am a Disney fanatic. Oh, I love going to Disneyland. I would love to check out every single Disney thing out there. You know, Disney Adventures, uh, Disney World, Euro Disney, Disney Hong Kong, Disney Shanghai. Um, isn't there a Disney China? Or is that Shanghai? I don't know. I think that's uh, Shanghai. Well, if there, if I'm missing any other Disney's out there, just let me know. I know they want or they're planning to build one out here in uh, San Francisco, but the city turned it down. Big mistake on their part. I mean, they already have Industrial Light and Magic, um, Skywalker Ranch, and things out here. Uh, Pixar's out here in this area. I mean, why not bring Disney up north too? I don't think it would be as a uh, grand scale as Disneyland at uh, California Adventures, but hey, it would have been nice to be able to go there instead of trying to save up a bunch of money and uh, have to find a hotel, drive down, food, gas, and everything. You could just make a day of it and come back. I mean, it's only like a 45 minute drive from me to San Francisco. Of course, you know, it's not about me, but why isn't it about me? <laughs> yeah. Just enjoying life and just doing what I can. You know, while the world goes crazy around you, you just got to keep a positive attitude and just do what you got to do to keep yourself and your family going. 